you guys. All right, so like Nathan just said, my name's Elena Waxy, and I'm gonna admit, I don't understand all the ins and outs of corporate personhood. Like, after numerous hours researching on my own and at political science courses at the University of Minnesota where I'm a student, there's still aspects of this issue that make my head spin. But I refuse to believe that just because I'm not a constitutional scholar or an attorney, that my voice shouldn't be heard. And that's why I chose to get involved with Move to Amend, because I think that major change can occur when we unite and start local. By using grassroots organizing techniques like door knocking and phone banking, uh, Move to Amend works to empower the community by giving everyone an opportunity to, to participate and showing how everyone can make a difference to end corporate rule and legalize democracy. But we have to realize that democracy means participation even if you're not an academic or a member of society's elite. It means getting involved in grassroots organizations in your own community. It means coming to City Hall on a Wednesday afternoon to show your local representatives what issues are important to you. It means not giving up even when you're working to change a systemic problem that seems larger than life. Because sometimes this idea of corporate personhood seems too big to fail. And I can't afford a lobbyist. I can't afford to hire someone to make sure that higher education is more affordable. I can't afford a lobbyist to protect my reproductive rights or my human right to clean water. Yet I can afford to get involved. I can afford to speak up. I can afford to spend time coming to City Hall telling my local representatives that civil rights belong to the people and corporations aren't people. And that's democracy. A democracy that can't exist in the first place unless we as citizens assert our rights. Because as Wellstone said, this is no time for timidity. This is a time to stand up. This is a time to take back our voice. Yeah.